The Attorney General Professor Gidho Mwegai has handled, handed over more files on Anglo leasing to the Swiss government. Mwegai gave five open files to the Swiss Ambassador Jacques Pitlou. Even though the Ethics and Anti-Corruption Commission was present, it was ambassador, the ambassador who was put on the spot over the timeline of the, of the investigation. The director of public prosecution announced last month that his office would soon reveal the names of the 10 architects of the Anglo leasing scam. For me now, Your Excellency, this is for transmission to your federal authorities. We hope this material would further help you bring that case to finality. Thank you, sir. You may want. So it was three to four months. What have you gathered so I was able to confirm from the Swiss authorities that Kenyan money is being held in Switzerland and that money will be repatriated to Kenya. You can quote me on, and I would consider that progress. How much it is, uh, who took it there, when it will come back, that is still a work in progress, and we should leave it there. Now it's going at the right pace, but the right pace is still a bit too slow to your liking. Obviously, you would like to have a closure very soon. You would like to see results very soon. That is not the way very complex uh, financial investigations work. I cannot give a timeline. What I can say is that the only thing I know from our prosecution office is that they are fairly optimistic that they will come to a conclusion. How long it will take, they wouldn't tell me.